Hey, it's Dave from Dave Tries This, and last week I brought you the very first news on the Elegoo Fecta laser engraving and cutting machine. The Fecta has just gone on sale on Kickstarter, and I've got some more information for you about it. If you want to see my original video, you can click up here, but this has all the specs for the machine, including some that were not in that original video, so you can probably just stick to this video. And I'll have a link to the Kickstarter in the notes below. So Elegoo, who makes both resin and filament printers, is expanding to do laser engraving machines. You can think of this like a desktop size Glowforge for about 20% of the price. I have to say, I've never been so excited about a product that I don't have a need for, but I know that the second I see one, I'm going to start engraving everything I can get my hands on. Like, I'm probably going to engrave my cats. And then I was thinking, like, imagine bringing one of these to a craft fair or a street fair and letting people pick designs to etch on their products while they wait. I'm getting ahead of myself, but this is the kind of thing that seeing a product like this makes me do. Elegu says that after two years of development, the first batches of the Fecta will ship in June of this year. Lasers for everyone. Pew, pew, pew. Here's everything you need to know about the Fecta. Keep in mind, I haven't seen a unit yet. This is from the company's press materials and their Kickstarter campaign, so I think all of this is true. The Fecta engraver has a massive 1600 square centimeter area. That's 400 millimeters by 400 millimeters. It's huge. It's got an aluminum alloy frame that's not only light, but it also has a rounded profile that I think gives it a modern look and it will probably look really good over there on my desk. What about smoke? No problem, they say. This is one of the questions I got asked a lot after the first video. Will it release smoke as the laser does its zappy stuff? Elegoo says that the Fecta comes with a magnetic plate on the Z-axis and a see-through cover, creating a sealed, noise-free workspace. Space. Elegoo says that it even filters out fumes and dust, and in fact, some of the Kickstarter kits come with some extra filters. This is what Elegoo has to say about it. The smoke exhaust filter and laser head fan effectively guide fumes and dust generated through the engraving product through the filtering port, reducing unpleasant odors. The filter cartridge has a detachable cover for easy removal and filter replacement. Now, it said reduction of fumes. It didn't say they're going to eliminate them. If you're going to use a thing like this and it's going to make any fumes at all, especially if you're engraving in like plastics or something like titanium or aluminum, really make sure you have good ventilation on this. The other question I got a lot was about controlling the Fecta, it looks like there's a couple of options. You can control the Fecta remotely using an app or use the engraving software you already use like Lightburn or Laser GRVL. When it comes to the laser head, they call it a next level head. They say that it uses a satellite orbit module for optimal cooling and protection. No bed slinging on this thing. They also say that the horizontal structure with the ventilation and dual fans makes for good heat dissipation, which should keep your lasers working nicely for a long time. The company says that the machine is precise. It says that it has aerospace grade POM material V wheels, material five. I don't know. What is that? Can somebody let me know? Sounds cool. What they do say is that this makes for a more stable laser, which makes for less wear and tear and a longer life for the machine. Elegoo also says the Fecta is super quiet and the power supply has been designed for safety and stability. Personally, I'd hope that all power supplies were built for safety and stability, so yeah? Elegoo says the Fecta can be customized to fit the project and user. The feet are adjustable so that it can move up to accommodate different height objects. There's even a roller so you can do things like thermoses and mugs. And the interface is able to be customized and supports multiple languages. And they give you free goggles, which is important when you're using lasers, right? They say you can engrave almost everything. They say the Fecta can etch, carve, or cut materials like leather, wood, bamboo, tile, humans. Wait, no, I read that wrong. Sorry, not humans. The 20 watt optical power of the bigger unit is enough to do most materials, but thicker units might just be etched and not cut or engraved. Obviously, the 10 watt version is not as powerful as the 20 watt version. As far as pricing, the Kickstarter pricing shows that the early bird price on the 10 watt engraver and cutter is 240 bucks and $400 for the 20 watt. At $170 and $430 dollars respectively you get a 10 watt or a 20 watt unit plus five filter cartridges at 360 dollars you can get the 10 watt with five cartridges and a rotary attachment and a honeycomb working panel that same thing is 540 dollars for the 20 watt version of that i don't know what a honeycomb working panel is either so if you have some information about that please let me know below i assume this is not for laser engraving beehives Finally, at $540, you can get two of the 10 watt machines, and at $860, you can get two of the 20 watt machines plus all those accessories. Let me know in the comments if you're thinking about getting one of these machines, and since I'm in touch with the PR team, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below and I'll get you some answers. Again, I'll have the link to the Kickstarter below, and if you like 3D printer and creator news, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, and if you enjoyed it, hit that subscribe button. Up here, you can find more of my honest reviews. Over here, you can subscribe to the channel, and down here, you can get some sweet, sweet merch. For Dave Tries This, I'm David Schloss. Thanks so much for giving this a try.